here today with Skip DeBrusque, local author, historian, who's got his memoirs all put together in this book. Tonight he's going to give us a presentation. What's the title of your book? Codfish, Dogfish, Mermaids and Frank. And that actually is uh, about the fourth title. Uh, we, we went through a whole series of uh, meetings about this title, and they ranged all the way from the very mundane to the unusable to uh, just about anything that could end up in the trash basket. But this was the effort of both the editor and the producer, so that's what we ended up with. The cover and the picture looks like a fishing boat. It is. It's an eastern rig dragon named the J.O. Stanley and Son. And it was an interesting experience for a young person. The skipper of the boat is Frank Savory. Frank is a Promotion. He lived just up the street from me on Winslow Street. And Frank served seven years in Alcatraz before I met him, not without reason. And Frank is a character. He's a colorful guy, if you know what I mean. And uh, so we had a lot of good times together, and some of those are recorded in here. But he also turns out to be my mentor. And I like to say to people that uh, very few people have a mentor from Alcatraz. I'm one of the lucky ones. So is this Lobster Man from Alcatraz? <laughs> how, how old were you when you were working with him? Um, I started when I was 15 working with Frank. I worked summers all the way through high school. And I was extraordinarily eager to drop out of high school. Frank was much more determined to keep me in high school. At one point, uh, I went to Frank and I said, Frank, I, I'm, I'm going to drop out of high school and I, I want to come to work with you and do this real manly fish stuff, you know. And, uh, uh, inspiring, yeah. Frank, uh, Frank said, absolutely not. He said, you're not coming to work with me, with, with me or for me until you have a high school diploma. Well, that was a little bit of a setback, so I decided to go to one of the other skippers, Charlie Silver and Fleet, and uh, I said, Charlie, I'd, I'd like to come to work with you. I'm going to drop out of high school. And Charlie says, absolutely not. I just spoke to Frank Savory, and, and that just isn't going to happen. So Frank had made the rounds of the fleet. He'd talked to every skipper there and convinced them all that hiring me would be just about the worst possible thing that they could do. So, um, so I did graduate from Plymouth High School in 1953, and, uh, and I've never regretted that. That's great. So, as a mentor, a manly guy doing very manly things, you also had a son side of him that was preserving your your ability to, to go further. Yeah, yeah. Frank absolutely was an alpha male. Uh, he'd walk into the room, and everybody, male or female, would pay attention to him. It wasn't the way he walked. It wasn't, it wasn't the way he dressed, certainly. Uh, but people just inherently knew that one of the brightest people in that room was Frank Savory. And Frank would, uh, Frank was also, a po he loved poetry, so there's a little bit of poetry in front of uh, each chapter of the book. Well, that's a taste of what this book is about. Codfish, Dogfish, Mermaid, and Frank. And it can be found at a local library or at a local bookstore. Thank you. Thank you.